All right, so we are at 110 Olinda. Um, so this is going to be all the package units, okay, for 110, 120, 130. 140 is on the other side, you probably can't see it right now. There's no way to really see it, but that's on the other side. Um, that was the unit that was having the gas leak. Um, so, as you can see up here, um, there's a crawl space, but I'm not gonna use that. There's literally no ladder in here. Um, these filters were changed about a year ago, more more than a year ago. Um, I don't know if you can see this here. So, so these were changed about more than a year ago. Um, doesn't look like you guys, this looks pretty clean though so far. Um, this doesn't look too bad. Um, these are recommended you change out once a year, um, but this looks like this hasn't been changed in a year, or maybe you haven't used it in a year. Who knows? Um, so that's what's happening here. Um, I'll go ahead and close this back up. And these two, so these two filters are up here, and this unit's filter is actually down um, in the in the office, in one of the offices. So this one doesn't have one specifically, but these two up here were changed a year ago. Um, so again, this is more than once a year thing. They look like they've been serviced, so I mean, it's not terrible. So they, but they're still okay for now. Um, so you can kind of see that. Uh, so these units were put in in 1999. So this this is already pretty old, okay? Um, as you can see here, the production date is from 1999. So these were put in 1999. Um, that's the same with all of these. Uh, they are they're all five tons. Actually, no, wait, these are all, it's three, yeah. So, actually three ton, three ton, four ton, I think it's the four ton. Double check. But, yeah, these were, these were put in in 1999, so you're going to have an older unit. The one in 240 that was having an issue is even older than that. Um, th these aren't terribly old, but they are getting up in age, uh, so, um, just keep that in mind. Any services done with a unit like this, um, I mean, with an old R22 unit like this, um, it's again, it's better to just use them until something happens, of course. Um, you know, general maintenance would be condenser cleaning uh, if you need it. Yeah, this, these look okay, they're not terrible. Um, you know, condenser cleaning uh, once every couple years and then filter every once a year, okay? And capacitors every year so that's going to be the general maintenance that's going to be required for these package units um, there's nothing that i can see that's wrong so far thermostats look okay inside i, I just don't see anything else that would require service at this time uh, this is a good nice flash in here for the water the water channeling um, so that's basically it with these there, there's not much here um, to kind of say other than these units are you know from 1999 they are getting up there in age um, so that's something to keep in mind not as bad as that one that one's from that was from the 80s so um, the one from 140 is actually from the 80s so that one's a completely different unit that's super super old but that's basically it here for the three units uh, or for the three suites that require service it's one package unit per suite so they're all located up here so that's basically what, what you're looking at in terms of service. Um, and then also evaporator coil cleaning if, if you need it. I, but looking at this, I don't see any of those issues um, arising. It's mainly capacitor for reliability um, and filter changes pretty much. And we just, again, we wanted just to make sure this is reliable as long as possible because again, these are kind of old. So um, this will conclude this video for Melinda.